Okay, here we have another word problem from Ronald. Um, so it says, a certain restaurant offers a build-your-own cheeseburger menu. Um, there are five bun options, four meat options, six cheese options, and a choice of four sauces. If customers are allowed to choose one of each, how many possible cheeseburger combinations are there? Once again, I'm counting. I want to count the total number of cheeseburgers that I could choose, okay? So let's go through here. The first thing I see is that um, I'm going to be choosing my bun. Okay, so the number of those choices, um, and I'm going to be choosing my meat, my cheese, and a choice of sauce. Now, the next statement says, if customers are allowed to choose one of each, how many possible cheeseburger combinations out there? And I don't um, feel like arguing <laughs> about, well, what if I didn't want mine on a bun? What if I said no cheese? What if I said no sauce? Let's go ahead and take the problem at face value. We're going to just choose one of each of these. Okay. So again, when you do a counting problem like this, you just give the number of choices for each one of the events. So we take a look at the bun. How many choices are there of bun? There are five options. Now for any one of those buns, I could choose a different meat. Okay. And so I'm going to multiply by the number of meat options. I'm already up to 20 options with just the bun and the meat. Okay. And I need to multiply that by the cheese options and that by the sauce options, okay? Um, and that will give me the total number of choices I have. So five times four would give me 20, and six times four would give me 24. I like didn't leave myself enough room for scratch work here. And 20 times 24, let's see, what would that be? I think 480. Okay, so I have 480. If I just choose one of each possible, cheeseburger combos. Okay, hope that video made sense. Um, so once again, you just look at all the things you're choosing and you go ahead and multiply your number of options times each other and you will get uh, to your total number of options. So if you have any questions, ask them in the comments. Um, Otherwise, uh, your own math questions, you can drop on my Facebook page, Light and Salt Learning, or my YouTube page, and I'll be happy to answer them for you.